Muslims from around the globe are gathering in Saudi Arabia to perform their first Hajj pilgrimage since the outbreak of the coronavirus pandemic. And before going to the holy city of Mecca to perform their Hajj rituals, they will visit the second holiest city in Islam, Medina. There is a lot of historical, religious and cultural significance to the city which makes it a very special place for Muslims. Medina is the city where the Prophet Muhammad and a group of his early believers migrated to in order to flee the oppression they faced in Mecca more than 1400 years ago. This migration is known as the Hijra, which marks the beginning of the Islamic calendar. Many verses of the Muslims' holy book, the Quran, were revealed while the Prophet resided in Medina, and many important events in the development of Islam in its earliest years happened in this city. Also, the second largest mosque in the world, where the Prophet himself is buried, is located in this city. Famed for its green dome, Masjid al-Nabi, or the Prophet's mosque, was built in 622 CE by the Prophet himself. To the southeast of the Prophet's mosque is a cemetery where many of the Prophet's relatives and companions were laid to rest, including four infallible Imams. Although it's not obligatory, Muslims visit the Prophet's mosque at least once in their lifetime during a pilgrimage. Now, many of Muslims say they feel more serenity when they are in Medina than anywhere else in the world. Our presence here is a great opportunity. It's like a spiritual update. This is where man gets tranquility. Yeah, uh, like I said, this is my first experience. Yeah? And I'm, I'm, when I'm here, I'm, I feel that, that Rasulullah is very really close to me. Yeah. I feel like I'm in the presence of Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. You can experience a sort of a spiritual serenity here. According to the Islamic tradition, a prayer in the Prophet's mosque equals a thousand prayers in any other mosque. Mahdi Abbasian, Press TV, Medina.